Tidal power. You heard me. It's tidal power. The energy from the constantly fluctuating rise and fall of the oceans. The water goes up, and then it comes down. Up and down, up and down, twice a day, every time, flowing through massive turbines that have the potential to power cities. After all, they literally run off the power of the moon. That's epic. And this is revolutionary. Unlike solar or wind power, tidal power is predictable, consistent, and stations can operate for hundreds of years, making 100% clean green energy. They can solve the renewable energy crisis and finally remove these forever. And they operate off water, which you may know contains vastly superior amounts of energy compared to a little air or sunlight. Even more, they can be built almost anywhere. The 372,000 miles of Earth coastline has countless opportunities for tidal power stations. Want another advantage? Sure. Tidal power comes in many forms, suitable for many different situations. Tidal barrages, underwater tidal turbines, tidal lagoons, floating tidal turbines, they all work, and even more variations keep getting developed. By now, you may be thinking this has to be too good to be true. Well, it's not. Before, tidal power was looked down on for being too expensive. However, major advancements have significantly reduced tidal power costs. Now, countries are fully realizing its potential. South Korea recently spent $560 million on a tidal barrage station, and now China, India, and the UK all have plans to build their own. Why would they spend hundreds of millions of dollars on something that was not effective? They wouldn't. Even more, tidal power stations aren't eyesores like those huge coal burning or nuclear plants. They are efficiently stored underwater or on coastlines, saving hundreds of square miles that would otherwise go to this. This is now definitely way too good to be true. There have got to be some sort of disadvantages. Well. There's just one. It is worried that tidal power stations would destroy marine habitats. But wait! Tidal lagoons and other solutions have solved this problem, so there are no disadvantages. Trust me, I want to support something that harms our beautiful underwater worlds. But since it doesn't, this is literally the best renewable energy ever. Now, let's recap. What affordable green energy? Tidal power. Want to save tons of land? Tidal power. Want a proven effective green energy resource? Tidal power. Want energy every day? Tidal power. Want energy from the moon? Tidal power. Want to knock this down? Then tidal power. Do you want an energy source that has no disadvantages? Tidal power. Finally, do you want to stop pollution and have a clean green planet for your children, grandchildren, and all future generations? Then it's tidal power. This is the real deal. There's finally a renewable energy resource with a bright future ahead. If you want to support tidal power, share this video and spread the word. We need to save our planet immediately. Also, please like and subscribe to further support my video and this cause. Thanks for watching, and be glad, because we finally have something to rely on. Now go out there and spread the word.